Hello guys, John Fake to Well Map Brand New Video. Today I am taking a look at the brand new Dot 2 Special Edition Power of the Daleks. Now if you don't know, Power of the Daleks has already been released. I watched it when I first got it and I really enjoyed it. Um but they have actually improved on the animation. This is the actual first time ever. They've improved on the animation. So they've already done the animation, but now they've improved on it. So this is kind of weird. This is like what they do with like the um, black and white episodes, like which one we just had, what's it called? Enemy of the World, where we had, um, they found it, they released it straight away. They didn't improve on it, you know, hugely. They just, you know, made it watchable. And then they improved them, you know, the screen, the colour, which that came out and had documentaries on it. That's what they've done with this, but they've done with the animation and the colouring itself. But it's black and white, so they improved on the black and white colouring. No colour version on this one. Um, but there is a Blu-ray and a DVD. The DVD is twelve ninety nine. The Blu-ray is seven ninety nine, seventeen ninety nine. Um, it's gone down two pound both. For some reason, I believe it was the other one, 15 99 They got £2 off for some reason. Comes out the 6th of July, my birthday, 2020. Um, and we have special features. So I will read the special features out to you. Two documentaries about Power of the Daleks. 903 BBC audio version of Power of the Daleks, narrated by Tom Baker. Raw intercool music. Butter Gary feature. Wicker's World. I don't like my monsters to have optical complexes. Daleks, the early years, a 1982 documentary presented by Peter Davison. Robin Hood, 1953 episode. Patrick Trout's early years surviving TV appearance. BBC archive footage from BBC Region News, BBC Breakfast, um, Blue Peter and News Night previous unreleased animation trailers so that's kind of interesting what could that have i've heard um it's the highlanders but now i'm hearing it isn't that so it'd be cool to see some unreleased stuff but apparently it's not the highlanders which we'll get to in a minute um audio countries by annika wills on each episode animation test footage photo gallery, gallery including previous unreleased and rediscovered full Colour onset battles 1966. Servants and Masters, the making of Power Dikes. Got to the Highlanders, which I believe it's just a Teddy Snap reconstruction version. It's like 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 how they did the Power Dikes, but that's gonna be on here instead. Um just a you know reconstruction version apparently of Power Dikes, not a proper version. Um but they're going to do, you know, the best um, of that. And there was actual some surviving um, footage, so I wonder if that will be on here too. I've heard a lot of people complain about this release, saying, oh, they want it on a box set, um, season four box set. I mean, what's a problem? If you like Doctor Who so much, this is good for me anyways, because I'm not into those box sets, but if you're into Doctor Who so much, why not just get this? And then when it does come out, because it will come out with probably more, then get the box set, you know, when it does come out. I have no problem with this. This is absolutely cool, in my opinion. But what do you guys think? Leave down below. Everyone has their own opinion, I suppose. Be um, be nice. And, yeah, that's the end of this video. Please like, subscribe, and see you next time, guys. Thanks for watching this video. Take care, and bye for now. Take care. Bye-bye.